So what they've done is underneath the panel, there's imperceptibly small little raised dimples actually on the surface of the screen. And these absorb light rather than reflecting it back. So what you get for your money there is much, much deeper blacks. So the blacks are able to be blacker than you'd normally get on an LED screen, and they don't reflect light off of the screen. What we've been seeing is actually very, very impressive. The kind of blacks that you'd normally expect of plasma TVs rather than LED TVs. And as I mentioned before, the LED backlighting goes across the entire panel. There's 224 differently controlled zones. And this allows the TV to be much more sensitive in its contrasting between the dark areas of the picture and the light areas of the picture. So what we've learned looking at this model is Mothai, if it works, seems to be doing something pretty damn good because frankly, we're not seeing the kind of reflections on this screen that we are off of this screen. Deeper blacks, crisper whites, and very, very good contrast. Now, until we put the TV through its paces at our test lab, we can't give you a full verdict. But in the meantime, it's very interesting to see what Philips are doing with their top of the range models.